welcome you all here where you're watching from all over the world on YouTube, Twitch, Facebook, and Twitter, or here in the arena. We have such a great action-packed show for you this week. But first, I just want to introduce my partner in crime, Mr. DJ Flax. How are you doing today? Pretty good, pretty good. How y'all doing? Are you amped up? It's overload, baby. Let's go. It really is. And I was going to give a quick rundown of what happened last week so you can be caught up for this week. So... The Morgan's training has started with our women's champion, Kia the Shield Maiden. As Morgan, Morgan took on Black Ops 3, it looked like at first that the Morgan was going to win, but she got a little impatient at the end, and it cost her the match, as we saw Kia was not happy about it. LG advised a clearly still confused Revel that he needed needs the performers here performing to make money. And if she isn't at 100% next week, it's... And, or if she isn't at 100% next week and is cleared to be... Cleared by medical professional, she'll have to find works elsewhere. How rude, right? To make things worth backwards, Chairhead, I mean Barbie comes across Rebel at a very vulnerable moment of frustration and it seems to be hatching a nefarious plan. Yes, we'll wow. see. But we also had some really good matches. Brandon Exito was back and this time he left the ring with a win over the always pleasant Zack Rage. Right. Venomous Nicole also made her debut on Overload with our resident Miko Priestess, Natty Darkmoon, who gave her a proper, proper overload welcome and walked away with the win. Great to see Natty again. We also had awesome. a, my awesome team member here also debuted his new talk show, Flexing Your Voice with TLC and the Ace. You know, there was a lot of, a lot of um, hard words and criticism going back and forth, but in the end, the Ace said if, T if TLC wants a match, there's two challenges he has to win. He has to win uh, a match where his hands are going to be handcuffed with Ace as a special ref, which will be happening here tonight, folks. Woohoo! And then the second challenge, he's going to have to win a handicap two versus four elimination tag match with the Ace as his partner against four other superstars. Holy crap! And just That's when you think you... There couldn't be more, anything more possibly that happened. You're totally wrong. Our heavyweight champion, Danny, clashed with Uncle Bobby in the main event. Us commentators finally were blessed with some of Uncle Bobby's famous cornbread. Heart to Uncle Bobby. And the mind games continued to play with Danny as Omen's music started. He played late into the match and unfortunately it cost him the match. Who or what is behind these games? And you know what? I'm really livid about that. As you know, I voiced my opinion last week. Danny is getting screwed. I'm sick and tired of all this crap that's going on. And I hope for Danny's sake that he's going to come out here and he's going to, like, call out LG and production and make things right. Because this is ridiculous. I wonder if Danny's going to come out today. Because if it was me, I would be raising all kinds of hell. I totally agree. Totally agree. It's just, it's... It's just been chaos. Okay, folks, take a look in the back parking lot. Something seems to be going on. What a nice car. What? What, what's happening? Whose car is that? Wait, that? That's not Danny's car, is it? Oh, damn. Wow. I, I don't. I, that is a very nice car. <laughs> very nice car. Wow. Uh, no, I, no, I don't think. Who? Who? Uh, does it, I, I mean, does what? it have anything to do with what's been going on with Danny? All right, folks, the following contest scheduled for one fall. Introducing to you first. Weighing in at 200 pounds, 5'11", from a little town of Dallas, Georgia. It is the Rebel. And it looks like she has that medic with her. He is here to see if she is ready enough to come back full time. 
Yeah, I hope so because, I mean, there's lots that's happening ever since she got hurt at the end of last season, and she hasn't really been 100%, so I hope that she's okay. Even she said that she was at 99%. Exactly. I, I think it's her memory that is still plaguing her the most. Um, she doesn't seem to fully have that back. So it's. I, right. I'm really hoping, though, that she gets you know, better soon. Hashtag Rebel Nation. There we go. So make sure you check it out. Hashtag Rebel Nation. Mm-hmm. Oh. All right. And her opponents... Standing at five feet, 120 pounds, from Okayama, Japan, she is Nady Darkmoon, Ireland. Now, Natty is one of my favorite performers. It's always a pleasure watching her. She is so fast. Those combos that she does, it's just amazing. And she is highly respectful of her opponent, and she always honors them by bowing before every match. Exactly. And after, too. Yes. But I hope that um, Rubble doesn't think that Natty's going to take it easy on her with this match because she is honorable, but she is fierce. <laughs> I think, I think, I think this could be a really, really good match. And we'll see more hopefully that, you know, Rebel is definitely her memory's getting better. And we shall see. Yes, absolutely. And we have the lovely Sarah Ashcroft as our referee today. Always good to see Sarah. A very competent ref that knows how to count. You know, <laughs> right? This match is a make or break for Rebel, really. I mean, she has to prove that she is fit to be back in the ring after those devastating injuries she had last season in that match with Kia. Um, can she? I mean, she has to prove that she's ready to be back in the ring. I'm just hoping she can do it. Yeah, me too. Because it's going to be an uphill battle. There's something definitely going on with her. And I hope that she can stay focused in this match. Me too. And there is the bell, so this match is started officially. And there's the bow. That and there is earlier. the bow. They're scoping out one another, sizing each other up. Now, Perhaps just building a strategy. Just because uh, Nadi is tiny does not make her any less you know, fierce and deadly with those combos and kicks that she does. Oh. And Speaking even though she's little... already going for the body punches right away. She you is know, dynamite right off. Dynamite comes in small packages too, you know. It really does. And man, with that big bump, she just took Rebel right down to the mat. And Ooh. Oh, and that twin boot stomp out. I always love to see that. Look at that. That <laughs> kick. A handstand leg drop to top it off. Wow. Like you said, she's not going to take it easy. But what's this? Rebel just oh. pops up like nothing happened. Oh, my God. Ouch. N and Natty didn't even see that. On Natty. She did not even... Natty did not see that coming. I don't think we did either. Right? Just out of nowhere. Throws her in the ropes. Natty comes back, but a oh. super kick to the face! Oh my Drops goodness! Drops Natty to the mat. I and mean, Nat she oh, goes for the pin. Oh, that's a quick pin. Oh, only, only a two count. A two count. It's way too soon. Way yeah. too soon. It's going to take a lot more than that. But I, I like the fact that she's capitalizing. 
Exactly, because you never know. You just catch them on surprise at the right time. Oh, oh the and that buster drops her buster. back down to the mat. My goodness. I'm gonna have to give Natty the card to my to my guy to help fix with the, you know, the face <laughs> being busted and the teeth, loose teeth. Yeah, I gotta I gotta get her fixed up. All oh, those fury punches. Ooh. To top it all it's off. It's floating. Oh, and a fleet. Oh, into the center of a floating neck it... breaker. Oh my god. The, found, the fans are sounding really great out there tonight. Let's hear y'all. Who are we cheering for tonight? Are we going for Natty? Or are we going for Rebel? They're split. Woo-hoo! Oh. Oh. oh, and is that... TP armbar on Rebel. Ouch. But apparently she's not done because she released it. Yeah, I, Natty knows it's going to take a lot more also to keep Rebel down. Oh. <laughs> oh. Big jump. Body Knocks point. Back to the man. Wait, is, I have a feeling there's going to be some back and forth going on here. Natty and I Rebel are two too. fierce competitors. They definitely are. And, and let me tell you what. Also, those punches are probably going to hurt even worse because... Rebel is so frustrated over everything that has happened that, you know... Oh, oh the taillight oh. warranty! <laughs> oh, my goodness! I thought she was going to counter, was a... but she transitioned into she her signature finished. move. Wow! Wow. Oh, Natty feeling that one. See, I, that's going to hurt. Oh, yeah, definitely. I think Rebel is trying to end this as quick as possible. I think so, too. But I don't think it's going to be that easy. Oh, no, no, definitely not. She has whipped her and... Oh, my God, it's that new move I've heard! Madder than a went in! Oh, my God! I've heard rumors! God, it was... I couldn't believe that. Madder than a went in! Let me tell you what, that is, uh, I love the names. I'm loving the names people are coming up. They're being so creative. When, when but, our wrestlers create these moves, is this like the production that is forcing them to have the name or do they actually sit like by in a table and like, hmm, and then right? name these things? <laughs> oh, and Rebel with those punches. Matter than a oh, <laughs> <laughs> hey! <laughs> gonna give her her create, gonna give her creativity an A plus for that one. Yes. Oh, and what's going on now here? They are these women are the still and another hammerlock here. back and forth. Oh my goodness! They are reversing it on each other back and forth, nonstop action, only on overload. Yes, I agree. This is definitely awesome. These fans are they are in party mode tonight. Woo, yeah. Oh, oh, both of these women look pretty tired. Uh -oh. What's not it? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Wait. My oh my god, she took Close she line. took Rebel Ray out out of the ring. Clothesline to over oh. the top, out of the ring. Right onto that solid ground because let's face it, those mats aren't that thick. Those are, but I hope is she okay. Hello, Natty. Rebel, are you okay? I don't think she landed too There's, good. And I see the medic is closed, just watching. But okay, she seems to be getting up. She's a little bit wobbly, a little bit wobbly. Are you okay, Rebel? Uh, are you okay, Rebel? Oh, she's, she's drops oh, drops her face to the ground. Oh no! Oh. She might be careful. You don't want to hit her head too much. That she's that could she hits completely. her head again. That could send her into a relapse. Oh, the, the medic that moves in horrible. right away to, to to check on Rebel. She 
Get off of me. I got this. Get off of me. I'm fine. Ugh. I'll be fine. Just just go. Well, she sees she's saying she's fine. It's, you know, telling the medic to go away and she's she's up. She definitely she's, seems a little dazed and confused, though. She's a little she bit of confusion. She, she seems a little out of it, so I'm not sure. I mean, we have top-notch medical facilities and team here at Premier Wrestling, so, you know, she should listen to them instead of just brushing them off. But if she thinks she's okay, I mean, I just she's hope still she moving didn't, around. Yeah, I just really hope she didn't hit her head again, That's because that's, that's very dangerous, but... There she comes back with Natty with that toe kick. Well, Rebel throws Natty into the corner. Oh. I tell you, in those corners, there's no cushion. Oh, Oof. and oh, and oh, Rebel drop comes back to with the face. Grab she just drops Natty like a hot potato. Oh, a knee face buster, single oh. knee face buster on top of it. I would say maybe she's okay. Uh, yeah, I guess she is, but wow, what a comeback. Oh, wait, where's Natty going? Why? Natty's going up. No, she's going up to the top rope. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, Rebel, you might want to snap out of um, it. Rebel, be careful. Oh, my oh. God. Ground slash pin right into oh, pin oh. one, two, there needs to the pin three. One, two, three. Your winner, folks, is Natty Darkman. You know, wow, Natty, that was a great performance. I hope that that Rebel's okay. Uh, I think the medical team should still check on her and not just go by the whims of what she's saying. I agree. But the winner of this matchup, a legit match, is Natty. Dark Moon Ireland, ladies and gentlemen. Delightful Mochi is a fun, inclusive hangout providing fun entertainment with the club, arcade, farm, and fairgrounds. Visit us at Lost Kingdom 144 13126 or contact Zami Cat Resident for more information. That's Z A M I E C A T Resident. Oh, so, I so call yeah. it. Oh, here he comes, folks. Here he comes. Our heavyweight champion. Thunder. 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 This, it's Danny he, Thunder. These mind games have got to stop with him. They have plagued him since last season, and it, it, it's not fair. It's not. I hope it's we not, get answers and I tonight. I definitely voiced my opinion about this. This is ridiculous. And uh, Dicko, little mummy back there should probably, I don't know, stop his progressive shite. Cut know, my damn music right now. I don't want to hear even hear that tonight. Cut my music. Oh yeah, take your time. Oh, finally. Thank you, production. <sighs> oh, you wanna know why I'm here, right? Huh? Because I don't like to play games. I mean, I'm just... Show up when it's time to show up. Because you need to know something if you didn't get that. I'm not a monster. As LG is trying to picture me recently. Over and over and over. Show after show. Match after match. Season after season. No, I'm not like that. Because I'm a person that is working for the fans. Working hard for the fans. And this championship that I'm holding proves it. No matter what, it proves that. So listen to me now, LG, wherever you are. You better show up. Because I'm sick and tired of your stupid and silly mind game. I am done with that. I didn't come out here to play your game. I'm here to prove that I'm the real champion. And I'm not a paper champion as I'm being portrayed on social media. Oh, by the way, 
I didn't come out here with the championship to take a selfie and post it on the social media as every one of you is doing recently. No. Wait, is this more mind games? Oh, like Danny should be absolutely furious. Is it really him or it's just more crap and games? Oh my God, is it really Derek? This what is happening? I don't know. Is Derek this, Zane is Derek he here? Zane, is he actually here again this time? Was that or, his car? It's a nice car. Uh, wow. It's is what's so, what I have to say about that? It's a nice music. No, it's not my taste, honestly. And yes, Derek Zane, as it looks like, but I don't see anyone. Is that another game that you're playing over there, LG? Why are you failing? I'm not falling into that. So? Um, this is, this we, is, I mean. We have a meeting with production, I think. Right? What the I, I, I don't on? know. I think I, it, it's, I fully I blame LG. It, are, are we going to? Somebody's gonna, playing games. Maybe it's not production. Product, the production. Production. My... Do I have to come up there to stop you doing this or what? Because I'm really getting tired of this. I think they got it. should be right now. I think I left my extra, lar, extra strong margaritas up there by accident. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Here we go with the music but nobody seems to be coming out he's the heavyweight champion and being so disrespected like i do not understand i have never seen a heavyweight champion be disrespected like this this is getting rid oh oh wait. are you to your damn time finally <laughs> well damn lg it's, it's is gm a mummy lg finally came out to show his face Bottom Mummy LG finally came out! Wow! Oh, wow. I wonder what he's gonna have to say. You know it's gonna be a lot. I hope Danny kicks him in the throat, to be honest. That would be nice. I'd be down. I'd, I'd pay to see that fight. <laughs> uh, you haven't enjoyed what has been going on? Don't enjoy that bit of music that I put out there for you? Shut up, all of you. Who cares what you think? This isn't this isn't your show, this is my show. In fact, this is a show just for this man here. You see See, you've you've been causing problems for me. And now with Xander Garcia out of the way, you have really been my only problem. And the only reason that you are around here is because you have that belt in your hands. You see. You bring the numbers in, and you bring the crowd in. But really, if we can take that out of your hands, what are you? What is he? He's just another boring Italian wrestler that no one cares about. So I got me thinking, how would I take that belt off you? Oh, certainly I wouldn't want to get my hands dirty and bite you myself. So I thought, hmm, I can have a look down the roster find out who really would be good enough to take you on and i got to be honest there's some fantastic wrestlers here there are some fantastic performers from across the grid from across the world but none of them quite had the ability to break you you see that's what i want to do i want to break you you're my little toy here at premier wrestling and I don't need you anymore. Now, you come out here every week, Danny, and you tell the people you're a fighting champion. You're a person who will stand there and you will fight. So I ask you, Danny, will you defend that belt? Who? Against the so-called wrestler in the roster, or 
You got the balls to remove that fancy suit and face me for this championship, rich boy. <laughs> Nothing would give me greater pleasure than taking my fist and ramming it down your throat. But, you know, there's rules being the general manager and uh, not allowed. Now, there was no coincidence that I came out to a certain set of music. That's right, people. Derek Zane is part of Premier Wrestling. Derek Zane has heard all about your wrongdoings, Danny. All about how you treated the people like trash, how you cost Xander Garcia's brother his career, how you how you, you were so evil that Xander Garcia himself had to leave the wrestling. You've just been a monster. You should be ashamed of yourself, Danny. You should be ashamed. Yes, boo him. Boo him. How, how bad he's been. What the hell are you talking about? I'm not a monster. You're a mind gamer, by the way. I'm not a monster, like I said well, before. Well, well, let's just say somebody hasn't been told all the details. And somebody back there is very, very eager to meet you. In fact, he's so damn eager to meet you that he wants to meet you in this ring next week. He wants to meet you in person. And that person is going to be... Derek Zane, and he is going to break you like I told him to, and like he should. This is going to be your final stand. Now, as the general manager, I'm not going to give you a choice. I'm going to force you. Because next week, you are going to defend that belt. And if you lose, Bye bye, Danny. Bye bye. And how about we make it fun? How about we add a little bit of spice and entertainment for the crowd? How about we remove the rules, regulations, and everything that ties the matches down? This match next week will be an anything goes match. What do you say to that, Mr. Thunder and Lightning? That's all you got. That's all you got. You think I'm afraid? You think I'm shaking, right? Well, let me tell you this. It's not like that. No, it doesn't take that to give me some fear. But I guess that you will get some. Because you know what? When I'm done with Derek, you're next. Game on, LG. Game on. You see, the thing is, Danny, you have fought many people. No, no, don't walk away. You have fought many people. You have fought SMF. You have won many battles. You've fought Xander Garcia. Now, Xander Garcia is a strong individual. He is a brute of a man. And SMF is a very skilled fighter. He's one of the best. He's one of the fastest wrestlers we've got. You've fought people like the Ace. Very tactical. But you have never, ever fought somebody with the history, skills, and the monstrosity that comes with Derek Zane. And you step in the ring with this man, you are stepping in the ring with not just one individual but a man who has fought more battles than all of the performers here put together so you better bring your agent because i don't play and nor does derek say he is going to break you Well, well, damn. Um, well, that just happened. At, uh, at <laughs> least, you know, at least 
we now know kind of what's going on. So, wow. So, there, what an there amazing you have match it. That, that just got set up for next week. Next week, Derek guys, Zane I mean, versus Danny the Thunder. Oh, my God. You don't want to miss that. In fact, get your tickets now for next week. Wait, are they available now? We're going to wait till after the show. I don't think they're. <laughs> Thank you very much, Rasgar, for that awesome donation. And let me tell you what, all donations do go back into Premiere so that we can bring you more and more great, great matches and shows like this. Desires Immortals Incorporated is a multi-purpose sim with Foundation Church, Immortals Dragon House Auction, Desires Immortal Incorporated Studios, breedable rental areas, and more. If you'd like more information, contact Dragon McPherson or visit us at Aura 154-146-33. There's a special match coming to you right now. Scheduled for one fall. It's a handicap match. Introducing to you first. From Cherokee, North Carolina, at 6'11", 310 pounds, the one, the only, my brother from another mother, we're talking about Cherokee Outlaw. And he has his beautiful, beautiful manager, Morgana, with him. You know, th this, is, this is tough. I am definitely rooting that for TLC that he can overcome this. But I respect both of these guys. I'm real good friends with Outlaw. I've known him for years. And it's absolutely amazing that he's here on Overload now. I can't it, wait to see what happens in this match. This is definitely going to be a good one. I mean, he's gonna be handcuffed. For TLC is gonna be handcuffed for this match. Yes, and, 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 the ace is our special guest referee for this match. Right? That, so, I don't know. I don't know if this is going to be a fair match or not. You know, that all depends on if ace is true to his word and he wants to see if TLC can overcome. Now, is he going to do his shenanigans or is he actually going to see what TLC has in his repertoire? if he's quote unquote worthy enough to face him. So it could go either way. But I tell really you right could. now, I tell you right now, if the ace interferes or does his shenanigans or whatever, he's only gonna make himself look bad. So there's a lot writing on this match. There really, really is. Either way, it's definitely going to be entertaining, folks. I think, come I on, TLC is going to be handcuffed. Of course it's going to be entertaining. Hey, I hope it took my always... advice and worked them mm -hmm. legs and them kicks. Uh, I'm telling you. Hi, Morgana. Handcuffs. Hello, Morgana. Air hugs. And let me tell you what. It's always a party when there's handcuffs involved. <laughs> um, you know? You know, so, uh, PG, <laughs> keep it PG, I guess. Hey, well, yeah, yeah, you like to play. even follow them? <laughs> right? All right, here we go. High five. His opponent, the challenger, set by Ace from the Bronx, New York. Forget about it. It's TLC. Oh, 6'3", 220 pounds. Can he overcome the massive Cherokee outlaw? I guess we are about to find out. TLC has been, he has been doing amazing. And you got to interview both him and, T and him and the Ace last week on your new show. How did that you feel? Know, it was great. I can't believe that they both accepted the invitation to come on the show. I thought for sure Ace was just like, no, I don't have time for that. Or however he talks, you know. Right. But he came out and... Nobody beat the hell out of each other, and we had a great show, and now here we go. We have our first challenge for TLC to overcome. Because of yeah, it. So it's great. Exactly. Did not expect this to come out of an interview, but we are happy. Two amazing performers. 
And I can't wait to see if TLC's been training them legs like I told them to. Man, I'm so excited. <laughs> and I don't think I've ever seen that kind of a match. I mean, I I heard about something like that in the past with, with Overload and stuff, but I've never actually seen it live, so I'm pretty excited. Yeah, I'm really excited about this one. I mean, Cherokee, uh, Cherokee definitely has the advantage, not only with his height, but the fact that TLC will be able to do a lot with his hands handcuffed. Do we know right. if he's gonna handcuffed in the front or the back? Probably behind right. his back. I, I think it's behind his back to so make it and as here, as possible. Here All right, we go. Joe. Here we go. Here comes your special guest referee. The EDA. You know, I, I heard that what they're yelling in in the audience here. I heard that this hole is actually trending on Twitter. <laughs> would not surprise me at all. <laughs> yep, there it is. Hashtag Ace Hole. Yeah. It's been trending. Right, there he is, folks. He's in the ring. I just... I just... I don't <laughs> trust Ace. I do not trust Ace that he is going to hold to his word. Like, he's going to actually be a fair rep. Not with the way he has been. Right. Well, like I said, it could go either way. You know, if he is trying to vet him to see if he's worthy of fighting him, maybe he'll call it down the middle. But if he's being typical Ace, who apparently wants to cause shenanigans, he could not be fair. So it could go either way. It's yeah. a 50-50 shot. I yeah. really don't know. But I've heard, I've heard in the background, Cherokee, you know, he is all about honor. And this to him is, and it really is an unhonorable match. So... I think Outlaw is, is definitely hesitant for this, so... Well, I, it looks I, like the, the, the cuffs are on and the match is underway. Yep, like I said, behind his back. Cuff behind his back. Here we go. <laughs> and uh, right away, TLC and Outlaw are circling each other, sizing each other up, and building a strategy. And TLC, I gotta say, I mean, he's got... Nothing but an uphill battle here. He starts kicking his thigh right off the bat. I mean, what can he do? But, or TLC. But Outlaw I mean, grabs yeah, his leg already. I mean, yeah. <laughs> TLC can't even <laughs> grab him or even try to hit him. He can't get his arms. From, oh. He's just going to have to... Dodge, this is gonna be like what? He's gonna start doing the Matrix moves? Like. <laughs> Maybe a lot of flipping? I that don't would. Know. I, and of course, here comes this, the outlaw punches to the dome. Eggs, of course. Yo, just punches him straight into the corner. TLC's backed into the corner. Handcuffs behind his back. What can he do? He can't even block his face. He just has to stand there and take the punches. Uh, I mean, it's like the it's, slowest count I've seen in my entire life. Come on, Ace. At least be. Come on. Give him a chance. Jeez, man. This <laughs> is totally unfair. Totally unfair. Wow. And you can tell that Outlaw is very uncomfortable oh, with this. He's just laughing at him. Come on, Ace. Really? Come on, man. Uh, like I said, I mean, Outlaw is definitely probably a little hesitant on this, but I, he's he's got to do his job, which uh, I it sucks. Well, the Ace Ace is uh, in a predicament for sure here. 
Outlaw pulls him into the ring and goes right back to kicking his. I mean, you what? Know I... <laughs> Poor TLC, man. He's kicking his thigh. He's trying. Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> this is. But Outlaw's just standing there, like, okay, Al, yeah, you're hurting my leg. But he's not knocking him down. I mean, maybe he has to get him on the mat in order to have a chance here. I mean, he can't grab him. He, uh, what is he going to do? It's, I, I really don't know. Yeah, unless he can get out on the ground and he can use his feet to, you know, fight. I, I, I don't. It, oh, yeah, oh, like. Overhand chops. Morgana just said Cherokee is full muscle. So not having to use <laughs> your hand, he's going to have to run and hit. Outlaw as hard as he can to try to knock him over like a big tree. Yeah, we oh, have them sledgehammer arms just pounding on you like Ow. that. You know, that's, that's 310 pounds in a chop. 310 pounds. Oh, but what's this? Uh, KLC managed oh, to get a super oh, kick. Oh, he did. Wow. Oh. And TLC is finally in this in this fight uh, he, but he, he should not let outlaw get back up because oh and you see the the shooting star oh my god <laughs> and this is what tlc is gonna have to do he just can only he rely on his on hand mat. It, he, he has to keep him on the mat so it, it's a level game. Exactly. Really? TLC is so fun. Really? Oh, TL Come on, Come on TLC. TLC. You're smarter than that. He's got guts. He's got he's got character. He's got charisma. But come on, dude. He's focused on the match. Wow. Oof. I guess it seems like I, I, I'm hearing that Outlaw was only going to use his legs, but Ace oh. said no, that he has to fight with his hands. So Oof. TLC All is definitely committed. Could be felt over here. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Both men, I think, are going to do the best they can, even though Outlaw doesn't obviously want to do this. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I feel and, and Ace is up there telling him to throw him out. Jesus. I don't know, man. Ace totally oh, oh, and that slam out. Oh. And he couldn't even put his hands out to to try to oh. stop when he hit. And wait, Ace is calling so fast. Wait. Oh my God. Come he on. This is wow. worse than Earl. This is worse than when we had Mommy out here. Mommy Trey out here doing refereeing and not paying oh. attention. Oh, I was just tossing TLC around like a rag. But he looked. TLC stood on his own feet when oh he got God. thrown out. Another belly to belly suplex. Oh, man. My Poor TLC. Oh, this is just as hard to watch. It really is. Oh, so brutal. Why? This, you know, this... I think. I think TLC got lucky. When he got thrown out of the ring, he landed on his feet. That was the he only did. way that he was able to get back in so quick with that extremely fast count that I've never he, seen in my entire life. Yeah, he is fast. I mean, he was like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and he was back in. One, he, two. I know. Oh, my God. Oh, look at how fast that count like... is. What is happening? <laughs> Come on, Ace. Oh, my goodness. That German suplex. Ouch. TLC can't even. Wow. Is this Ace telling him to hold him for one second? What? He's, he's just stomping on his ribs while he's down. 
Ouch. I don't know. How long is picking TLC back up? And Ace is taunting the crowd to get in their boots. Oh. He's loving it. Oh, some kind of backbreaker. My goodness. Oh. oh, the pain that must be searing through TLC right now. I mean, he's trying to get his, seat, his feet. Ola is letting him get to his feet. Which is good. It's that grit. Uh, it's working that core. Let's hear it, the folks. Muscles. Let's cheer. Let, come on. Let's cheer on TLC. Let's give him the strength. Oh, TLC's coming back with some toe there kicks. We He's go. really trying. He's digging See? down deep, folks. The more you cheer. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh. A cyclone kick. Throws Outlaw oh, over the top rope. Oh my God! The power the outside. of outside. The power of that kick. I mean, TLC. I think he definitely took your advice and worked on oh. his legs because of course. he has he, shown he some amazing tail. feats of agility here tonight. Right, right. And why is it Ace isn't even count. counting? Ace isn't even counting hardly. I didn't think, is he counting at all? Yeah, Come on, three. Ace. He's at three. He's doing a normal sanctioned count. Wow. Uh, maybe he stopped because he's show voting or something. Have <laughs> oh, we complained about Earl? Maybe Outlaw's back on his feet. Counts up to five. What? I don't, I don't understand. Well. Outlaws back up to his feet, had yeah. plenty of time to rest with that really slow snail count, and he's back in the ring. Yeah, Morgana's worried about her client, rightfully so. Um, this whole match just, it, 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 this shouldn't just be, and none of this should be happening. Oh, straight up Liu Kang bicycle kick, and knocks him down. Nice. Nice little bicycle kick from TLC. And the ref is. Oh, those vicious, vicious stomps. stomps. Wait, what? He's Wait, climbing what? the turnbuckle with no hands? What? Oh my god, be careful, TOC! You, you're gonna oh hurt yourself! You're gonna break something, what? man! He's on the top rope, TLC! Oh my what god, is he gonna careful. do? Oh my god! My Don't good. do it, Ace! Oh. No! Oh, miss a drop kick, but does oh. not connect! Outlaw gets out but of the way, rolls landed. out of the way! He landed on his feet! He's still upright! Wow! Holy uh -oh. crap! Uh oh, Outlaw's got a bear oh. hug. It could be over. This oh is no! He, is he still conscious from the Oh no! Hunt? Outlaw goes for a pin, but right oh, away oh, right. TLC kicks out. Oh uh, wow! It's only a two count. He kicked out as fast as possible because he anticipated the fact that Ace was going to be like one, two, three, like really fast. So he kicked out as soon as he was covered, just in case. Yeah, I don't. And how the hell them. did he do that? That's amazing. Yeah. But I mean, as you watch Cherokee closely, I mean, he just, he's really, just seems to be going through the actions. He. What? Oh. <laughs> Wait, what is. Oh, Ace wants, Ace wants him to pin him again. Jesus. Come on, TLC, you oh, can do look at it. Oh, leg sweep kick. Drops out oh. back down to the mat. TLC is really bringing his A game in this match. Look at his shooting star press. Holy crap. No handed I... shooting star press goes for the pin. I cannot but believe what Ace we are too witnessing. Busy picking his nose. He finally oh, gets down to go for the count. TLC is covering one. him. TLC is. Come on. One. Oh, come one. on. Come on, Ace. I don't know. Maybe there was oh. a cr cramp in his arm or something. Oh. Move it. Yet, I, I no, he didn't. I That's just him being an ace. He is definitely being the ace hole. Yeah, I can see why that's trending. 
Well, hey, you uh, need to go back to elementary school and learn how to count. On. I think Taylor's the same subject. It must be hard counting the three when you're scared of me. But if you had any guts, you'd ref this match fairly. <laughs> well, TLC's apparently had enough. Ace is just laughing it up. But Allah's right behind TLC. You better turn around, buddy. Oh my god, Tomahawk Chop. I think no, it's over. this could be it. This is this could be the end, folks. Ace is already down and ready. He's already down and ready. Like what? No. You know, you know, Ace, they make pills for that. You oh. know, the, the premature. Oh, the Hurricane Rama. Actions. He also oh, comes back with a Hurricane goodness. Rama. Drops Outlaw to the oh. mat. Folks, he is oh. doing this with no hands. Uh, His here's hands your chance, are handcuffed Ace. Don't make back. me say it again. Come on. Prove you're not scared of the rookie. Here, I'll start you off. Okay, here goes one. All right, check this out. Oh, my right, goodness. Here's one. What? Now it's your turn. Count with me. T T Go T ahead. He goes for the pin. Wow. Uh oh. There you go. And... Oh, ladies and gentlemen, Wait. TLC did it. He did it. One, and two, three. He actually. Back. He pulled it off. My goodness. Oh, He's going wow. on to the next round. TLC, your winner. Forget I'm about surprised. it. Ace actually even counted to three. I am shocked. Uh oh. What's this? He's setting up for the ace mark? Oh, come on. Watch Don't out, mark. TLC. Don't Watch mark out, him. TLC. Do you have a. Oh, no. Watch out. Oh, no. Wait, what? what what's he doing? Oh, he's messing with him. Oh, I wouldn't trust that. I would oh, not trust no. that. Don't worry. Don't worry, kid. I'm not gonna ace mark you now. I like you, kid. I like you. Turn around. What? What's? Is he? Is he's gonna let him out of the handcuffs? Oh, he did. What? Oh. Boy, what? What's going on? You next what? On my side. Well, there you have it, folks. What a match. The ace outlaw. Wow. TLC, I mean, this is crazy. The ace ace did the right thing finally at the end there and, and counted like it was supposed to. Congratulations, TLC. That was absolutely amazing. Completely we saw, handcuffed behind his back. Over like David versus Goliath. He slayed the hell out of that giant. Good job, TLC. And we'll see you in the next round where you will face against four people right along with the ace as your tag team partner in a handicap. That's and, right. I just can't believe ace actually counted to three. Are you looking for a beach town with an amusement park that's right on the boardwalk? Or one that has an exciting nightclub and plenty of inexpensive homes to rent? Well, right here at Karen's Cove, we have it all. Look no further. If you would like more information, please contact Isaiah Zay Jenkins, Apollo Cypress, Nene Lyons Ember, Renee Simithorn Nickers, or Randy Glenfath. Well, well, well. <laughs> I wasn't lying when I said Derek Zame is here. Do you think has a fancy car like that in the back? Oh, I, I, I just wanted him to have a chance to uh, get some stuff off his, uh, off his chest. Uh, Derek. Thank you. You know they say when you walk into a dangerous place for the first time, you need to make an impression. Establish your dominance. And the best way to make that impression is to find the biggest dog in the yard, face that dog, and take them down a peg. And frankly, here on Overlord, that dog of dogs is Danny Thunder, your premier wrestling world heavyweight champion. Danny, I have been studying up on you, big man. Derek Zane is nothing 
if not thorough in his scouting, and I've come to a conclusion. You are not the equal of the only name you need to know in Second Life Wrestling. No, don't let it get it twisted in your head, champ. While you are an impressive competitor, a guy clearly blessed with skills and gifts. I mean, let's be honest, you are world champ after all. You and I, we're not the same build, brother. You see, Danny, you are champion because you want to win. For the people in the crowd, the ones watching at home, held the boys in the back. Most importantly, for yourself. For that sweet validation that victory gives your ego. And hey, when it's at the expense of the guys in the back that you take liberties on, all the better, right? But see, that's where you fall short of Derek Zane. I don't compete because I want to win. I compete because I have to win. It's a sickness, Danny. And that sickness is what propels me to action. A sickness that drives men to places the meek shy away from. A sickness that makes me suffer punishments and pains the common man can't even bear to consider enduring. And when I don't win, it's a suffering the likes you can't imagine, Danny. The pain of a broken limb, torn muscles, dislocated joints, none of it. None of that compares to the pain of not getting that fix that only victory can give me. That sickness is what makes Derek Zane great. That is why when you and I, we're never going to be the same, Danny. And when it's all said and done, when Derek Zane stands over your broken body, his hand raised high into the air, when you look up and you see what greatness truly looks like, you will understand at that moment why you and I are not built the same way. You will understand why Derek Zane is the only name you need to know. He is coming for Danny. He said Danny is like that one, that top dog to beat here. So, you know, that's kind of a uh, flattering, but the air, he, he, I don't know. He might not be even able to fit through the door if his head gets any bigger with that, with that ego. So, nice. I don't know, nope. but folks, we have this match coming up now. Here we go. Let's talk about this match. This match was set by our GM, Bottom Mummy. I mean, I'm sorry. The Lady LG. I mean, LG, right? And it's going to actually be for the lightweight championship, which we'll get into in a minute. Okay, I'll explain that. But introducing to you first, from Ireland at 64190, this is Harry Holland. And Harry uh, before we get into about Harry, the lightweight championship, it has been decided that due to the recent events that happened to... Uh, father freud uh, that we don't know how long he's going to be out so he had to relinquish the title and it's up for grabs in this match this is for the lightweight championship now you, what can you tell us about harry there fire well you know harry holland is a multi-time champion in the indie circuit you know he's been wrestling for eight years he was crowned as a top lightweight in his division over in China. You know? Wow. Can he win the belt against that? I mean, it's, we don't know what we're to expect from Harry. So I'm very excited to see if he can handle the chaos that is Zack Rage. Wow. Yeah, because you know Zack will bring the rage. Oh, he's just, it just, he it's, does. He, he's he, definitely that's rage. all that's in his bloodstream is rage. It's rage, more rage, even more rage, followed by rage on top of the rage. With exactly, the rage. exactly. Speaking of rage, from Motor City, bringing that Motor City mayhem at a height of 6'8", 250 pounds, it's Zach Rage. This, this, 
Oh, I'm so excited. I always love, you know, matches that the belt, you know, is... is and then this one, you know it's going to change hands because right now, nobody has it. Right. Because of the severity, the severity of Father Foy's condition, he's no longer able to defend his belt. So by default, he has to relinquish the title. And that's why we have this bout set up to crown a new lightweight champion. You just know that Father Freud was not happy. Oh, no, not at You're all. You're going to have to watch out when he comes back. But I, I heard he's recovering nicely. and yeah, There were some complications, but he's pulling through it. And uh, Zach hopefully and he'll be back with us in the future. Yeah, exactly. And there's Zach, of course, with his lovely messages to his fans. You can tell that he just loves them all so much. Right. Absolutely. And, true. yep, I think Sarah is about to start this. Well, everything seems like who, it's in order. Who are we going for, folks? Who do you want to see with the belt? Do you want Zach Rage? Or Harry Holland? Oh, they, started, Harry. they started cheering when you said Harry. So they did. Harry. That's uh, Harry's got he's he's got a big job ahead of him right now tonight. He's <laughs> got to uh, well. Look at the size difference. Oh, <laughs> there's only four inches between them, but why does it look like Rage is towering? Exactly. Towering over Harry. My goodness. All right, they immediately they are... lock up to start it off. I'm really excited to see what Harry brings to the ring. We, I, Locks we, you know, wrist lock. I've never seen him wrestle, so I always, you know me, I always love to see the newcomers and see what they're going to bring us, the excitement. The party, right, folks? Party! And it's always nice to see the awesome Echo Reigns here tonight. You know, according to... To, to uh, Harry's history, you know, it says he was crowned a top lightweight in his division when he was in China. So yeah. he might be equally matched according to that. I mean, it, I mean, if you've ever checked out mm. any of the indie stuff over there, I mean, there are some talented, talented performers in China. All so right, girl, we're on. We just have to wait and see how this goes. How it exactly. Goes. Exactly. And I mean... Oh, but no... Zach's not having it and oh, flips him right on his ass right away. Snapmare. With a wrist lock snapmare. Snapmares him yeah. too. <laughs> Especially because you're you're fighting Zach Rage. Hello. I mean, he might as well. Oh, oh Blackheart oh, driver. driver signature move. Connects. Oh. Goes for the pin. One. Two. Oh. oh, only a one count. Not quite two. It was Just one point nine 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 nine. Almost. It was so close. But well, Harry's not giving up. That's good. He uh, I, he's got some more life left in him. So I'm hoping we get to see more and more now. Wow. Zach's been kind of taking him to town. Folks, again, and this is for the lightweight yes. championship. One of these Either gentlemen is going to walk out of here with that belt. Took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> See? Toe kick. Oh, what's this? Ooh. Neck breaker. Ouch. Harry drops that to the mat. Ooh. With a brutal neck breaker. That's payback. Oh. That is payback. Wow. And some ground stops. To boot. Oh, yeah. Keep working on him. That's the only way to keep him down. Yes, you have to be aggressive. Otherwise, something like that will happen. Super it kick is... straight to the knee. Yeah. Harry. And you don't, you definitely don't want Zach to have time to gather his rage. Yep. Into the rope, Zach um, goes, comes back with oh. a crazy leg larry on oh. the rope and connects. Yes. Ouch. 
That's one of the things I think, you know, you got rage, you just blindly just act and it all happened so fast that, yeah. you know, right, he just explodes and I wouldn't want to be caught mm -hmm. in the middle of, or, you know, in front of that explosion when he... Oh. Armbar tackles him, locks it in. He's got Harry in the armbar. And folks... Stick around. Don't forget, we still have the main event coming. Kaylee the Baker versus Kia the Shield Man. I'm really hoping Kaylee oh my remember gosh. Our, our cake oh, this time. That's going to be so awesome. But yeah, she's going to be fighting Kia, our women's champ. It's going to be amazing. Always love to watch those ladies in the ring. I wonder what uh, Kaylee's baking this time. Did she bring? I know. This time? I, I'm hoping. I'm really hoping. I I need something sweet. But then the shield maiden, of course. Always love she's to gonna see. Going to set the bar, because as you know, she's taken on a protege who earned the right to be trained by her. That is right. The awesome Morgan. I know she'll be watching closely. Hmm. And Harry just whips Zach into the corner. That impact is insane. Ouch. There's, yeah, because there's no give on those cushions at all. There's, there's, there's not much to it, so. Oh, here we go. Here's that oh, 10 oh. punch combo. Corner punches. Wow. Oof. Oh, the oh, super famous monkey flip. The monkey flip. I know you Nene can never is happy. Get away from that. Even in China, they teach you to do the monkey flip. One they, of the most they do. famous moves to do in wrestling. The famous monkey flip. Harry monkey. <laughs> Majority of them are echo, yes. But, you know. <laughs> Monkey flip, let's go. Zach is in some pain after that. And Harry is going in for the pin. One, two. One. Uh, only a two count, Zach oh, kicks out. Only that a was 2.999999. Yeah, that was very close. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, Harry picks up Zach, helps him up. Only probably to knock it back down, I'm guessing. I'm excited, though, to find out who's going to win this belt. Right, we're gonna have a new champion at the end of this match. It's crazy. The Ooh. lightweight championship. And Zach is in there with that that kick. Oh, and the big oh, red big effect. Red effect from Zach. His, His signature. signature move. Oh Coach no, time. this I don't know if Harry can come back from that. Oh my goodness. Uh, I, think, nope. I think Zach's Zach is raging. Here again. we go. Look at that. He's, oh <laughs> my god, it's gonna happen. Oh my god, it's straight drops the oh. bomb you drop the bomb on me head connects to the mat zach goes for the pin one going, wait, two, that was a three bomb. it's over that was we a have great... a new lightweight champion zach oh my Rage god is your winner ladies and gentlemen what a great match a nice debut from harry holland but oh. it was not enough you shouldn't have drop kicked him in the face you wouldn't like him when he's angry and he showed you Zach Dunn whooped your ass. But good job, you guys. Wow. What a match. That was great, great, great. great and great. it was nice to um, meeting Harry as well. Hopefully we'll see more from him in the future. Pink Moon Estates is a mature, full sim that offers many social sporting activities like wrestling, soccer, and more. It's a place where you can hang out with friends, take pictures, play games, or get a professional picture taken at our photo studio. Pink Moon Estate also offers homes for rent, and you can set home there when in their group. For more information, check their website at www.pinkmoonestates.blogspot.com, and also you can contact Bullet Zebulon for more information. You want to come watch the action live in person, by yourself, or with your family or friends? Great, let's get started. Check out the description below and come to our arena to buy your tickets. Remember, space is limited. We hope to see you soon. Thank you, Adam. You have been a great help today. Um, and, and I know I did take a fall, but um, 
I know I did take a fall out there and I hit my head, but but it was just a little bump. I'm 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 okay. Um, my head's not hurting. It didn't even break the skin. Yay! Um, so I I will get this report to him uh, here in a little bit. So so thank you so much, Adam. Oh, let's see. Let me look at the stuff that my assistant sent me. Wait. Wait, I remember this. Are you kidding? Ah, oh, lied to me. Oh, she was never on my side after I woke up. She's going to pay for the shit. Ugh. You know what? I am going to make this Barbie bitch pay. Barbie, I challenge you to a match next week. Enter my ring. If you dare. <laughs> oh, Rebel calling out Barbie. She oh, knows that Barbie did not have her back. I sent her some stuff from last season, perhaps, because she just remembered what went down and she wants to exact revenge on Barbie. She does. Though she seems to have forgotten that she used Barbie in the first place. Thank you very much, right. Echo, for that donation. Wow. But this, all, I mean, all you have to do is hand Barbie a chair, and that, that'll <laughs> take care of everything. Hashtag Steve. You guys probably don't know about Steve. Steve <laughs> All right. Are you ready for our main event? Yes, oh, I'm please ready. bring me all the goodies. The following contest get to for one fall. Introducing to you first from Jutland, Denmark, 165.3, Kaylee the Baker. I don't know. I'm not seeing her bringing anything out. Or oh, oh, wait. I she does. She had it hidden from me. Is oh, that no. for us? Oh no. Oh my goodness. Is it chocolate? Oh. I think it is. I think it is. You it's know, the best combination in the world. Chocolate Haley. and tequila, folks. I mean Haley. <laughs> I'm making up names now, apparently. Haley, you know for a fact I'm allergic to chocolate, but thank you for the Oh. Combination. I guess that's all. Oh, for I that's right. See, I don't worry, I will definitely take care of your half. A proverbial slap to the face. Thank you. How I up to so all much. the time. Kaylee. Oh. You're breaking my oh, heart. Oh, that looks You're breaking my so, heart. so delicious. So delicious. And it's all so brightly decorated. It looks like definitely a good one. It's a pride chocolate cake for sure. It's Yes, put it right in front of uh, me. Yeah, again, happy Pride to everybody. Yes, happy Pride Month, everybody. One of my favorites. Not being biased, just saying. From from Norway, at, at a whopping 6'7". Tall as hell. At 235, she is Kia, the shield maiden, Norsewood. Kia! Skull for the north. Always love when Kia comes out, and you know that her protege uh, here is the Morgan, and she is here to watch. There, just alongside, just right over there with her manager Rasgard. I heard him, you know, giving some encouragement to, to the Morrigan. Hello, Kia! Don't worry, I will take care of this shiny, precious. We will have a drink, and then I will polish it, and I'll have some cake, and then I'll put it on. Yes, you will have and, some cake, and then you'll put it on. You know, I, I'll take very good care of the shinies. All right, I think we are getting ready to start this. All right, here we go. Sir, is this everything's okay? And 
and Kaylee's gonna hook me up. <laughs> That's right. Oh, look at that. I love seeing this. Look at they're shaking. Hand of respect. respect. This is going to and be a tough <laughs> and then and then Kaylee. Hey, well you you know you... I don't mean to laugh. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> she shook her hand, everything was great, and then slap Yeah. Slaps she, her right know, in the face. It was my type of girl. I mean, she's full, oh but then she gets right to the right to the the meat of the thing. You have to just get in there, especially with an opponent like Kia, who will be able to just roll over Kaylee. She's so, so much larger. <laughs> right. I can't believe she just did that. That's that's <laughs> Kia. You don't just slap Kia. Well, unless you've got. And now she's it. shoving her. <laughs> Kaylee, you're gonna. Oh, Kaylee, 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 Kaylee. What am I gonna do with you, girl? She is and her trademark stomping on her foot. See, I like this girl. <laughs> oh my God. What? What is happening? It's Kia. Why are you. I, I, I don't think I can call this. I, I know serious. it's very hard, but <laughs> you know, Kia just. Oh. And Kia, she is just punching okay. her. Folks, Kia is all oh. about honor and proving yourself as a worthy warrior. Oh, and that you don't DDT. Yes, oh. absolutely. Because that's what's going to happen. You're going to piss her off, and she's going to lay the boots to you. And then slam your head into the ground with a DDT, for example. You don't stomp on the foot. You don't slap her in the face. You fight like an honorable warrior, and she will respect you. See, you also got to look at it it's another Kia. way. But you have to look at it another way. Doing those small, <laughs> seemingly, like, uh, you know, <laughs> odd movements might be enough to take Kia off her game. Her game. Yeah, like, because yeah. she's, she's okay. not expecting it. <laughs> that might be her strategy. Maybe. But... Honestly, I feel that it's just going to piss her off. <laughs> exactly. It's, you know, just like a gnat on a brick wall. Although the brick wall will get it's upset. Like, like slapping a brick wall. It doesn't do much except for hurt yourself. Through that. <laughs> Through that. That is one wall I would not want to be angry at me. Oh, Kia is. Er, oh, ow, she is. Oh it God, is not is stopping God. Kaylee at all, and there she goes stomping on that foot. And her <laughs> that leg sweep was another one that she is good at. Oh, did oh you my see God. the air drop impact? She just totally took her right off her feet. Oh. Another leg and sweep. another one. She's like, no, you need to stay down. Well, okay, look, Kaylee, if you're going to go with the strategy of stomping on the foot and slapping and just pissing her off, you got to keep capitalizing because if she gets up, it could be over. Oh, elbow drops. This, this, this cake is extremely good, by the way. I really wish you could taste this. Oh, my God. Yes, continue to rub it in. That, that's perfect. <laughs> it's already bad enough. She said it right in front of me. I, so, I know, you know, I know. I, 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 hey, I'm so here. Have a, have a, have a tequila. Have a margarita. <laughs> now you're speaking my language. Tequila. Always, always, Rodgar, always. <laughs> All right, I, I guess you can give my piece to Nene. All right, Nene, here you go. Here you go, girl. You have some. Oh, Kaylee's going to the top turnbuckle. What's going to transpire? Oh, she is. It's going to be Air Cupcake. Dun, da da Flying Ooh. Splash. That's her oh, signature buttercream, buttercream frosting. Oh, and she's going signature for that quick. Move. She's going for that quick cover. One, nope. two. That, Only a two count. Yes, a two count. See, this, this cake's got me all messed up, man. I'm like calling stuff wrong. Just hurry up and eat it so it's gone, yeah. so I won't think about it. <laughs> you know, something, you know, more about Kaylee, you know, she is sweet 
as you know, as her creations, her her spine baking buster. creation. Ooh. Ooh. Her to a spine buster. Yeah. But she's yeah. she's been known to use ingredients <laughs> that she uses as weapons. I've seen her use power. Oh, that running Yakuza kick to the dome. Oh, drops that, down and she picks her back up. That stopped her party right there. <laughs> I think I saw some some sprinkles pop out of her from that impact. One-handed spine buster? Are you kidding me? Wow. What what sheer show of strength? One-handed. It this is just Poor Kaylee is. I don't know if she can come back now that Kate, that Kia has gotten control. Oh my my! My goodness! This is uh. Ooh, it's getting hot in here from this action. My goodness. It's on fire, these matches. Goes for the pinfall. One, two. Oh, are oh, we getting it? Just two the two count. Just the two count. That's going to be frustrating for oh, Kia, yeah. but She's man. really getting up frustrated. She's how not, is... This is pissing me off. Kaylee, though, she is one good. Like, she can take a beating, and man, but she will come right back. She does not stay down mm, very often. Right. But you know what? That cake is a lie. It's a lie. It's How is... It's, it's it's not lying at all, believe me. Oh, Kaylee's kicking her leg. <laughs> well, her I'm foot on again. that foot again. See, I, oh, I like that. that. I like that. That's, <laughs> that's my girl, Kaylee. So, I got to I gotta make her... Get her to make me like a tequila cake. Which is straight tequila and nothing else. <laughs> Pretty much. Just put a, you know, a, a shell of a kick and then put a straw in the top and I just right. <laughs> get out of there. That would be <laughs> Kaylee is. Got she that wrist is... locked. Wrist locked to arm drag take down. Ouch. She's working. working she is that working arm. that arm. Wear down Kia right now. Oh, striking from the wrist. Ooh. Another lockup. And there's a super famous monkey flip oh twice in one show. I Look know Nene is happy. She loves that monkey flip. Oh, it's some more loves. vicious stomps. Of course. Of course. Gotta get the stomps in there. Of you know, course. Because apparently she loves stomping on toes, so why not? Well, Razgard is yelling Razzard. at Kia. Yeah. Yeah, he, Morgan, yeah. Morgan, you can see the Morgan. She is watching this intensely. I'm sure production will be able to beat that out later. So. Oh, no, I'm what? playing headbutts. What? Oh. Ow! And connect. connect. Goes for a quick cover. Oh. One, two. two. Is this... Oh, so close. close. But no two. Cigar. That was that was very close. Raz is, is livid. He's absolutely livid at what's transpiring in this match. Oh, Kaylee. No, come on, Kaylee. No, no, no taunting. Look, turn around. Watch out. Turn around. <laughs> uh oh. Hello. Oh, uh -oh. This is... goes for the road. Oh, too. no. Full oh, force. Scared to watch. Bus. Busukai knee. So. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, that Busaiku is going to hurt. Connects. Ouch. That, that. I don't even know. Kaylee knows where she is now after that. Wait. Oh no, that headbutt, oh, oh my goodness. 
Oh my goodness, poor Kaylee. And now, uh oh, Kia's going up to that top rope. Top rope. Cough and drop. Oh impact. my God. Done. Next. Ouch. Boom shakalaka bow. Oh, no. It's over, it's, ladies and gentlemen. It could that was, be. That was, uh oh. Uh oh, Kia's setting up for it. Oh no. It's the Ravens, the, oh my god, the Ravens Claw, the Talons Claw, that is not good. I think this is over, folks. I think it's over for sure. We know what she is setting up for <laughs> now. The... <laughs> yeah, that, hey, night night time. Kia goes for the quick cover. One, oh, that two, was, yeah, that was three. Dope. It is definitely over. Oh, it is Once over. Once she connected with that move, it was done. It was done. Good night. See you. No, and your yeah. winner tonight, folks, it's Dillard, uh, our world Shield champion. Maiden, the world champion. Ladies, world champion, Kia Northwood. Uh, what a match, So Kaylee really took her to town. She did not... She did not give up. Lori again. Lori again. There you are. Did you see that? Did you see? Like I'm trying to keep it. You win with other Anna. You lose to them. You study your opponents. You wear them down one way or the other. Don't get too eager. Okay. That's all I have to say to you. Good night. For the North Skull, Kia Norsewood. Um, Words. Heavyweight so, women's champion showing the Morgan how it's done. For the North. Wow. This has been one amazing show tonight. I can't believe everything was happening. Let's see. Uh, the party just never stops around here. We saw Natty take on Rebel and win. Uh, Na um, Rebel kind of hit her head, but she seemed okay. She did get cleared by her the medics. Then she remembered and realized that Barbie did, was not her friend. So she it challenged. The fact she hit her head. Uh. Jogged your memory, got it. It okay. did, it did. Barbie is in for a world of hurt, I think. Then we saw the, the Cherokee Outlaw versus TLC match where he is handcuffed. And Ace was the ref. The best ref. It, was a, it was a pretty different type of match, but in the end, Ace actually did the right thing and he counted TLC one over the outlaw, so he is on to the next step of his yep. challenge. And that will be TLC and that, the ace versus four competitors. Handicap tag team exactly. action. That is going to be a good one. You do not want to miss that next week, folks. Then we had Zach Rage versus Harry Holland, and Zach won the new, the lightweight championship belt. He is our new champion well since, deserved. Father, since father Freud could not continue as he is still very injured and, and in recuperation and then we just saw kia come and wipe the floor with kaylee the baker yeah. i mean teaching the more again more stuff what and knife have we seen um and Derek zane Derek not zane that. Is back, you know, he's the one that's been playing. They've been playing the mind games with poor Danny. Derek Zane and Danny, it looks like we'll have a match next week. Oh my God, it's gonna be this, awesome. You do not want to miss any of these folks. I'm gonna post all of our links in the local chat. Um, 
join our Discord so you yes. keep up on everything. Uh, like, like and subscribe on our Facebook page. You don't, you'll just see all of our episodes there. Mid-season finale next That's week, right, right here on Overload. You do not want to miss it. I'm telling you, it will be awesome. It will be worth it. I promise you. Non-stop awesome action right here on Overload. Mid-season finale goes down next Thursday, right here in Overload. Right here. Do not miss it.